Hey, hi everyone, this is Gail here, and I want to share with you today my brand new plugin, and it's called WP Stealth Downloader. And uh, it's an awesome plugin, and you'll love it. What it actually does is it actually masks uh, your, uh, let me think, your hyperlinks to where your PDFs or whatever it is that you're allowing people to download off your website. So let me give you an example of how that looks like. So if you were to come to this particular website here, my particular website, and you'll see 56, way to market, 56 ways to market your business on Pinterest, and here is a big download button. Now normally what would happen is you would put a hyperlink. You would go click here to download Pinterest for business, right? And it would look something a little like this. And if you were to hover over it, or people were to hover over it, and look down in the corner here, you will actually see a link there, right? And that's normally what happens is people will have a hyperlink behind the words, but people can actually see where it's coming from. And some nasty people can actually even get in there into your back office or your, to your cPanel or whatever it is. And so the good idea is to mask it. Now, you could use other things to mask it, but it wouldn't look as pretty as this, right? <laughs> and so this is a fabulous plugin, easy, easy peasy to use. So all you have to do is once you've purchased the plugin, uh, you will download it. And then what you'll do is you will upload it. So you just come into plugins, go uh, add new, upload, and then it'll be uploaded. And then you just activate it. It's very, very simple to use. And then once you've activated it, you will see it here on your um, in your posts or your pages. And it's this little icon right here. It's a tiny little icon. And then what happens is when you want to, let me just show you here. I'm just going to take this. When you want to use it, you can write up your own little posty thing. So you can write whatever you want in your post, then you click on here if you have a PDF or anything at all you want people to download. It could be a video, it could be anything. So what we're going to do is we put the URL in here. So we'll put the URL in here. Then we'll give the button a name. Down, Of course you call it something really flash and fancy. Download here, it's just a test here. We can select a color, whatever one you want. Um, you can align it and then you can put in a different uh, graphic if you want now with this plugin We give you a whole pile of other special gorgeous looking download buttons that you can use and as long as you upload them uh, Then you go get the link and then you can pop them in here and it's very simple to do So what you do is then you'll have your code down here and you press the insert button and it puts it in right here now I'll just save it as a draft and I'll show you exactly how it looks. Now you can see in the back here that we can see the entire link and we know um, where that link is and um, where people are downloading it from. But if they come into here, they have no clue where they're downloading it from because it doesn't show. All we've got here is download here. And if you look down the bottom here, you will see it doesn't show where it's coming from. Now you can hide all sorts of things behind these buttons. Anything that can be downloaded can be hidden here. Now how do you, um, how do you get new buttons up or little pictures and things that you might want to use? Well, it's really easy. Just click on here. All the pictures we give you, this is what you can do. You can just quickly upload them. Let's go browse. I'm just going to find a picture, anything. Um, that's small actually. Let's just take this little one here. I hope this will work. So we'll go upload it and it's just going to upload it onto the uh, up into my cPanel here and then what happens is we don't want any of this information. All I really want is this link here. So um, I'm just going to click on it a few times, copy it. That's all I want to do. I'm not going to put it, insert it into the post. I just want the link. So we come down here and then what we're going to do now is we're going to come here to our little box, our little WP Stealth downloader icon. And then what we're going to do is when it comes up, we're going to add in the link here. All right, so we put the, uh, the um, button graphic here. 
Okay, so we're going to put the button graphic right in here. And then we're going to pick a width for it. Well, I uh, don't really know what width we're going to make it. So, I don't know. Let's make it um, 500. Okay, I don't know. We'll see how it looks. 500 by 300. That's really huge, isn't it? Um, let's make it a little bit smaller. Let's make it 300 by uh, 200. All right. I don't know, really. All right. And uh, so that's the... You don't need to worry about... Um, the button color you can select the alignment and uh, the button name you can write something on here if you want but you probably don't want to because you'll be using a picture and then what you can do is put the PDF URL up here okay so putting the PDF in there and now we're all done ready to go hopefully that's all got everything in there let's go to the end and make sure that's all in there uh, and then we go insert Okay, so it's all there now. Hopefully that's all going to work. And that's pretty well how it's done. It's not too difficult to do. We'll come back here. We'll do a little refresh and see what happens. We should have both buttons here. There we go. All right. So that makes it pretty simple, doesn't it? And uh, it didn't take the writing on here, but you'll find with all the little icons that we give you, it'll have download here or all sorts of things written on them. So if we were to click on that little button there, that's exactly what would happen. Now that's pretty cool, isn't it? And if you look down here, there's no link showing. And that's what we want. But here's another fabulous thing that, uh, that you'll see in the back as well. So we'll go back here. We'll go to Tools and go down to WP, oopsie, go down to WP Stealth Downloader. And what it will show us in the back is how many times that particular thing has been one clicked on and two downloaded so these are the two test ones I've just put in along with these other ones here and so you'll see that it's been clicked once and downloaded now how could you use this well I like stats I like to know if I'm promoting something on Facebook or Twitter and sending people back to my website to download something then I want to know how many people came back not necessarily uh, where they came from, I'm not asking for name and email. I just want to know if my marketing is working. And so all I want to know is how many people came from that particular advert that I put on Facebook or Twitter or wherever I put it, and how many people came and clicked on it, and how many people actually downloaded it. And so let's just say I ran uh, this particular one, I don't know, whenever. Let's say I, I ran it. And uh, 11 people came, 11 people downloaded it, that's cool. Now let's say in a two weeks time I want to run the same ad and find out how many people downloaded All I need to do was click on reset, it'll send it back to zero, like here. It'll send it back to zero and then we can start again. And I can find out what's working, maybe I change the wording on it a bit, all sorts of things. And uh, it just helps with your stats. So it's a pretty cool piece of software and I know you're going to enjoy it. Now we haven't finished the website yet because it's waiting for this video, but you'll see here the price $5.97 for a single user and $9.97 for multi-site users. So it's not expensive guys and uh, I hope you enjoy it and it will keep your uh, downloadable secure so that people can't break in or the other thing they can do these days is if they know where it's coming from, for instance, if you show them the link where it's coming from, like here, that's what usually shows up. Then they can send this to their friends and then they can download it themselves. And so what we're trying to do is protect your files. Whether it's a PDF, whatever it is, we just want to protect your files. So I hope you enjoy uh, WP Stealth Downloader. It's a fabulous piece of software. And uh, all the best. See you online.